Hey guys! You can start this tutorial using New Ball Paint Pop by MAC. It's just a base with a peachy nude color to it. And this is going right on my eyelid, in my crease, and up to my brow. Also, I'm putting it on my lower lash line. Now taking a dirty gold color, gold yellow color, this is going in the inner corner of my eye. Just patting it on to get the most color payoff here. Also putting it in the very inner corner near the tear duct and in the lower lash line and the inner corner. Going in my Wet n Wild Vanity palette, taking that ivory color, it's kind of a dupe to Brulee by MAC, and this is going in the middle of my eyelid. Patting it on again because I want the most color payoff, and also while patting, blending into the golden yellow color. Next, I'm taking a white base using NYX Milk Jumbo Eye Pencil and this is going in the very outer corner of my eye because we will be placing a eyeshadow that I want to be super pigmented right there. So I'm blending out the milk. Did that sound funny to anyone else? Yeah, I thought so. Eh. But be sure to blend out the base very well because NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencils always need to be blended out so that they don't crease. Now, taking this green, beautiful green color with a pencil brush. It's a nice little tiny pencil brush, as you can see. And this is going right where we placed milk. <laughs> Sounds so funny where I placed milk. <sighs> Slap the knee. Anyways, yep. Yeah. And I'm blending it outwards towards the outer corner. So it's in the outer corner and just blending it out. But mostly patting the color on because I want the most pigmentation that this eyeshadow color has to offer. The palette's by City Color, by the way. Got it from Rite Aid. Now, taking a bigger blending brush, and I'm blending that green and that ivory color towards the outer corner of the eye. Now, taking Soft Brown Dupe from the Vanity Palette. This is going in the crease with a fluffy blending brush, making sure there are no harsh lines to the colors that were placed previously. Now taking a shimmery creamy color, this is going to be my highlight going right under the arch of my brow. I love this color. This palette is just awesome, seriously. And that green, I'm bringing down into the outer corner of the lower lash line. And here's the final look. Um, I added falsies, mascara, gel liner, and pencil liner to my waterline. I hope you guys like it. So pretty full. Perfect for summer. Now taking bronzer from my e.l.f. duo blush bronzer duo thing. And I'm contouring my face with that and contouring my big forehead. Whoop whoop, gotta do what I gotta do. Now taking this beautiful pinky coral color, it's kind of light. I'm patting that color onto my cheeks and then blending upwards. And I will continue to add as much color as need to until I get the pigmentation I desire. But I'm gonna continue blending up. This is the final face look, and now taking Crew Highlight from the Hey Sailor Collection. Hey, hey! And this is going right at the top of my cheekbones. Mm, yep, now time for the other cheekbone. Down the bridge of my nose, and right at my cupid's bow. Next, taking Fime by NYX. Oh, I love this lipstick. It's kind of like C'est La Vie from the Hey Sailor Collection. And this is just going on the lips. It's actually pretty moisturizing, surprisingly. This is the final look. Thank you for watching, guys. I hope you guys like it.